Strap yourselves in for nine laps of speedway action in GT4 cars for the final race of the inaugural Midnight Graveyard Series. Norm and Jonesy, two points separate them, and away we go for nine laps. Schwaber takes us away with Beto. Zambi gets a good start in the Kit Kat Horasan as they all run down into the long run into turn one for the first time of asking. Nine laps to decide the championship. A couple of drivers with an outside shot. The big battle between Norm and Jonesy as they come round the flick left for the first time. Jonesy and Rick outside. Is that the championship slipping through Jonesy's fingers as they come round the right-hander for the first time into the 90-degree right? Schwaber leads us around lap one, followed by Beto, Norm, Mitch, Wings, Zambi and Con and Kiwi in eighth as we come around for the second time of asking, well, what a first lap. Jonesy gets taken out, jo Jonesy loses his line and then contact with Rick off track puts him back in ninth and tenth respectively. He's got a lot of work to do to bring it back as Norm looks up the inside of Beto. Con gets it a little bit wrong. A couple of drivers already pitting, Zambi's in the pits, Con's in the pits. That is a reminder, every driver has to take a mandatory pit stop. Schwaber, Beto, Norm, the top three, leaving us around lap three of this final race of the series. Norm in a very, very good position to take the championship as it sits. Two, la two points ahead of Jonesy, and then another ten points ahead of third coming into this race as Schwaber taps the wall coming into the last turn of the lap. Norm right on the tails of Beto. Schwaber out in front in a Mustang, giving it some legs. And we all know the Lamborghinis have a lot of oomph in this category as well. Mitch in fourth, trailing the, tr trailing the front three. Who's coming out of the pits now? Beto with contact in the wall. Norm ducks in for his pit stop. Schwaber and Beto still yet to pit. Mitch yet to pit. Where's that going to bring Norm out in front? It's all about Norm and Jonesy. Jonesy would have had to have made up a mountain of time to have a shot at the title, but he needs to secure that podium spot. Zambi taps the wall in the Horasan. Take a break, take a Kit Kat, have a crack at the wall. Schwaber and Beto, Beto just nicking into the pits as they both pit. Mitch comes around, Kiwi pits and Jonesy in behind him. Rick with the pit stop, Norm comes around to challenge. Mitch with a pit to come, we're looking at the two leaders here. Norman wings together. Where is the traffic gonna be? Has Norm got it right? As drivers rejoin in the track ahead of them, just before the kick left, this is gonna slow these drivers down. Norm's got it wrong. Unable to pull off the underlap, the undercut. As, as Schwaber and Beto come back out in front, one and two. With three laps to go in the final, Schwaber leads us around from Beto, from Norm, sitting pretty in a championship winning position from Wings, from Zambi, from Kiwi, from Jonesy, from Con. Are we going to see any final stint dramas to shake up the championship as Zambi comes out of the pits, almost a little bit of contact with Mitch as he comes round the outside. Kiwi up the inside of Jonesy, Jonesy looks for the undercut. Oh, very wide from Kiwi and Jonesy, very nice move up the inside. But it's not going to be enough but if Norm stays out in front where he is as we go to Schwaber leading us around with one and a half laps to go. There's Norm in third, the championship prospective winner if it stays like this with wings hot on his tail. Beto in second for his best performance of the night. <coughs> Schwaber coming around for the final lap, his best performance of the night, potentially with a win on the cards. We're just gonna leave that in, I can't be sodded. As we come round for the final lap. One lap to go in the championship, it's Schwaber from Beto from Norm. An outstanding performance by Schwaber and Beto.
Everybody on your feet for the final heat winners. Schwaber followed closely by Beethoven with the real winner here tonight, the inaugural champion of the Midnight Graveyard Sprint Series as Schwapper comes it in for the flag is Lisa Norm and he takes the title over Jonesy and Wings. What a night of racing as Rick comes over the line to finish it off. There you have the classifications from the final race, but it is the final standings that matter. Graveyard Series 1 champion Lisa Norm with 38 points. Second was Jonesy with 32 and rounding out the podium, Wings. There you have it. Thank you for joining us for the inaugural Graveyard Series. We'll see you next time. Ciao.